An earthquake just north of Julian felt all over the county. Good evening. I'm Steve Atkinson. And I'm Kimberly Hunt. The magnitude 4 quake hit at 430 was followed shortly by a 3.0 quake. And 10 News reporter Anthony Perret is live in Julian where they're preparing to cut power because of the winds. Anthony. That's right. It is a double whammy for this community tonight. You can see this trailer here. There's a power generator inside. They are planning on cutting off power to this community because of the high winds and fire risk. And when that happens, this generator will be what will power the town. Take a look at this. This is a picture taken earlier today of when they brought the power generator into town and they tested it. It is working. But then, as you mentioned, there was that earthquake that hit around 430 this afternoon. We have security video inside Mountain Spirits Liquor. The owner says he felt it. You can see him there running behind the counter. He says, fortunately, there wasn't any damage to his store. The shaking lasted for a few seconds. Everything was fine, but everything was shaken. The whole store was shaking. Do, 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 do. You know, all bottles, the shelves, you can hear everything. Again, I had a customer here and I couldn't wait. I just wanted to run and then I came back. I didn't know what to do. And we haven't heard of any damage in town from that earthquake. But again, because of the high winds and fire risk, there is the possibility of them turning out the pow power into town. And that's when this generator will play a very big role here. For now, we're reporting live in Julian, Anthony Perra, 10 News. Anthony.